Hi guys, it's me Paula and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another unboxing. If you're new to my channel, I'm Paula and I'm from Scotland and I do sub unboxings mainly on this channel, along with a couple of other things, but mainly sub unboxings. So today I'm going to be unboxing Rockabox for October 2020. Now I am a bit late unboxing it. It's still in October, so I'm still not that late, but I did have this for a few days, but I've just been so busy. So apologies for that. So this is uh, Rockabox. If you're new to Rockabox, it's a fantastic UK subscription. It is £10 a month plus £3.95 postage and packaging. And it I would say it rivals all the major kind of middle price beauty boxes, like, you know, your Glossy Box, your Look Fantastic, your Birch, but certainly better than the Birch Box. And I just think, actually, I prefer this box to all of those boxes. Um, I started off at the beginning of this year, and I don't think I've ever had a bad box by them. I'm, I'm going to curse this now saying that, but it's I've always been really impressed with it. They've had some really amazing products this year. So I'm going to open it up and see what's in the October box. So this is Rocker Box, October 2020, and we've got the leaflet there, and this is what the box looks like. And the little sentiment, it says, good things come to those who take their makeup off before bed, which is quite true. It says at the side, put on your war paint. <laughs> and then it says, throw sass around like confetti. Love it. So that's the, that's the box so far. So it says here, rock a box. Hello, rock a box, babes. This month we're bringing you our AM to PM themed edit. They always do really nice edits, I think. Uh, we have all the products you need for morning, day and night packed into a little pink box. We're stepping into your morning routines, protecting your skin from your daily smartphone use and helping you end the day with some great finishing touches. Lovely. As always, I hope you love this as much as we do. Okay, so the first item we're getting in here is... I'm going to look at this one. And this is Flossum Press Wonky Fruit and Sparkling Water Sweet and Sour Apples. So that sounds quite nice. <laughs> if you watched my unboxing of Lemonade Box yesterday, we had this really weird bump on zest drink. But this one that I think I'll, I like more because it's like sweet and sour apples. So it says here, these drinks are made with imperfect fruits that don't quite make it to the supermarket shelf. So it means that we're helping to reduce waste by drinking these delicious drinks. This one is fizzy, fruity and 100% organic. And it's worth £1.50 and it's from flossomdrinks.com. I actually, my husband and I at the moment, uh, we are we we are really, really getting on board with the sort of fizzy flavoured waters, the you know, the, the really natural fruit ones that and we buy a lot on Amazon. You can get so many great flavoured brands on Amazon, and we've you know, we like the kind of raspberry ones, the peach ones, and a lot of them are made with wonky fruit. They are a little bit more pricey, so you're looking at about maybe £12 for some like 16 cans um including postage but we just love them and it's totally to play soft drinks for us which is great okay we've also got another little treat in here and this is we've got a little leaflet about it here and this is the be kind protein bars and um, if you like these bars they do all, often do these really nice um nut bars like you know sweet and sweet and salty nut bars maple pecan maple and things like this and then we've got one in here which is the ma maple glazed pecan and sea salt one this is such a nice one i love it they are quite pricey these ones and it's saying here that uh, 199 this is a bonus one um and yeah it's they're they're absolutely gorgeous i love these so much i kind of sometimes in the morning when i'm really like on the fly for breakfast pick one of these up and i'm like trying to convince myself it's a breakfast bar but it's not really it's kind of like a sweet treat isn't it the next one we've got there are three as well they've given us one of their breakfasts the peanut butter um be kind breakfast this is like a protein bar these are actually really nice i've had these as well before they do a couple of different flavors are high in flavor uh, fiber made with oats millet buckwheat amaranth and quinoa so it just says there want a simple delicious nutritious breakfast that then kind snack bars are for you being gluten-free high in fiber and five grains it's bound to give you the kickstart you need ideal for an on-the-go breakfast and that's great so they give you they give you two there which i think is really good bonus i'm not sure if you're supposed to get two but i got two anyway um so that's that one okay the next one we've got in here is good old Ico making yet another appearance in a sub box. Um, okay, Ico is the I do I do liquid eyeliner, a vegan 
long lasting fade proof and smudge proof eyeliner that lasts all day and night yes please a single stroke color that doesn't skip or drag but glides on smoothly for that carbon black finish say goodbye to patchy lids the tip is the perfect shape and size to give the control the perfect cat eye look and this is worth 16 pounds and this is from Ico. Ico appears a lot in sub unboxes it's you know a bit like a van isn't it i thought this is much more affordable um, I do love Ico eyeliners. I think they're very, very good. But I'm a little bit fed up getting them now. I've got such a backlog of Ico eyeliners. And that's with putting stuff in giveaways. I've still got more. Um, okay, granted, I do get a lot of sub unboxes because this is a sub unboxing channel. But, you know, still, um, I do think, you know, Rockabox has, has featured this a few months ago as well. So it would be nice, Rockabox, to get something a little bit different um, other than the, you know, the, the Ico products. I mean, even another eyeliner from another brand just to try it out or a brown eyeliner. We always get black. And I know this is that's a more, you know, universal kind of color because everyone likes black eyeliner usually. But it would be nice to get maybe even like a brown or a colored eyeliner now and again. Drop down a comment what you think. Do you think it'd be nice to get a different color eyeliner? Okay, the next one I've got here is by Hair Burst and it's Volume and Growth Elixir. And it's a 40 mil and I've not heard of this. And it says here, it's a travel deluxe size. It says in an award-winning style spray that does it all and only contains naturally derived active ingredients. This vegan and cruelty-free formula enhances hair volume and gloss, protecting it from pollution, UV and heat. It detoxifies, improves hair density and reduces hair loss. As an added bonus, is right for, it is free from sulfates, parabens and silicones. It's a must-have and it's worth £8.99. So that'll be quite interesting to try. The next thing we've got here is, ooh, we've got a sample from Ole Henriksen, which is a great brand. I love Ole Henriksen and it is very pricey. And this is a Banana Bright Vitamin C Serum. It'll be quite nice to try that and um, to see if, you, if I like it. Firms hydrates and instantly illuminates with 15% vitamin C, 5% PHAs and hyaluronic acid. So I do like um, my vitamin c creams my favorite at the moment has to be the sunday riley one but it'd be great to try other brands as well Ole henriksen like i say is really quite big on websites like cult beauty space nk because it is a bit pricier the next thing i've got very autumnal i like it pumpkin infused sheet mask by Pla by beauty pro i do like their mask i love the fact that they always do like interesting ingredients in it and this one it says it's worth 4.95 this 100 percent plant beat ma plant based mask contains organically farmed herbs that increase cell renewal hydrate the skin and brighten your complexion amazing right the sheet is biodegradable mask from natural bamboo fibers meaning no irritation too perfect for that little bit of you time and i love the fact they put in a pumpkin one in october that's really cool the next thing i've got is a real hero product and like we see here hero product and it's mud masky blue light protection mask so i've tried a few mud masky things before but i haven't tried their blue light protection interesting i've been reading a bit about this at the moment when they're talking about blue light from your phone sort of you know can, can potentially damage your skin and i never thought of that before so this is quite interesting it's finally here sunblock for your smartphone and laptop is a perfect replacement for your normal day cream when you're not out in the sun it's perfect it prevents premature skin aging caused by hev light which is found in all types of screens interesting didn't know that until like say recently mud masky top tip always try to keep 60 centimeters away from your blue light devices does does anyone do not does anyone keep 60 centimeters away i think we're all kind of like that aren't we sometimes in the morning especially when we wake up and look at our phones um what is it? It's 30 centimetres about that, isn't it? So 60 centimetres, maybe about like that. I don't think anyone sits with it like that with their phone. Um, and this is worth £44. So this will be quite an interesting one to try. Um, I would love to do more research on that whole blue light thing because is it just a gimmick thing? Is this products to sort of prevent blue light, the effect of blue light? Is that just a gimmick? Do we really have a bad effect from blue light? Is it a real thing or is this just something that, you know, the makeup industry has made up to try and sell products? I'd be like to, you know, if any of you have done more research on that, drop down some comments or links below. I'd be love to, to find out more. Oh, and a Grace and Stella product. Not a massive Grace and Stella fan, but this sounds quite a nice one because I love lavender. And it's do your skin a favour, use me. And it's the lavender lotion, calming and moisturising lotion in 30ml. So... I've been using this lotion night before bed as it's infused with a light lavender scent to help relax your mind and body. Not only does it smell delightful, it's super nourishing and protects the skin for up to 12 hours. 
and it's worth four pounds i think it's like a sort of more of a, like a deluxe travel size one there so i'm actually using this works one at the moment body lotion before bed and it is beautiful the lavender i just love the smell of lavender and um, so that that's the box in total so this month we've got the lavender travel size lavender one we've got the mud masky blue light protection mask interesting I'm, I'm fascinated by that we've got the pumpkin spice uh, the pumpkin mask which i think is really cool we've got a sample of the olia hendrickson one we've got the volume and growth hair elixir so we've got some of your hair we've got the, a bit of makeup here with the ico eyeliner we've got a drink sample and we have some snacks i think this is a great box um some things i you know maybe wouldn't have bought in the shop so i wouldn't have gone out and purchased but actually i'm very pleased to sort of try them and um, i actually really enjoyed this box what did you think this month did you did you enjoy the box were you taken with rock -a box this month like i say rock -a box is sort of consistently good i think um with other boxes i've had ropey months sometimes good months other times but with rock -a box i feel that this that they've been consistently interesting and you know some is really high value as well anyway drop a comment down below tell me what you think and i will see you in the next video Bye bye